Common outdoor pests like mosquitoes, ants, and fleas can literally suck the enjoyment out of spending time outdoors. If you're a gardener, they can also do serious damage to your plants, which wastes time and destroys all the hard work you put into growing. Today, I'll share a pest control option that's all natural, non-toxic, and super easy to apply. Let's get started. Like most people, you probably want to keep pests away from your home as much as possible. Now, traditionally, effective pest control has involved the use of products that are toxic to both you and the environment. Not anymore. I recently came across a pest control option from Mirimichi Green that's very effective while containing organic, all natural ingredients. What this means is that it's safe when used as directed, and then immediately after application, kids and pets can re enter the area you just treated. It provides effective control against mosquitoes, ants, white flies, fleas, spiders, Japanese beetles, and much more. A huge advantage of this product is that the insects that it targets cannot develop a resistance to it. What this means is that no matter how long you've been applying it, it's going to work effectively. Now let's talk about some options for applying it. You can go with a traditional backpack sprayer, or for even more effective control, you can go with a misting system like the one shown here from Petra Tools. A big reason to go with a misting system versus a traditional backpack sprayer really comes down to one word, coverage. One gallon of the product mix when applied through a backpack sprayer is gonna provide up to 3,000 square feet of coverage. Now compare that same one gallon going through a misting system and you're gonna get up to 7,500 square feet of coverage, more than double than what you can get out of a traditional backpack sprayer. Makes for a pretty good reason why you'd wanna invest in one of these guys. I'll have links in the description for everything you see here. Let's start by adding one gallon of water to the misting system's tank. Next, measure out six to eight ounces of pest control into a measuring container. On a side note, this stuff actually smells really good. It has a subtle, like, lemon-lime scent to it. All right, back to killing these bugs. Carefully add the pest control to the tank and agitate to ensure a good mixture. Now, the missing system that we're using is run by outdoor wall power, so you'll want to grab an extension cord and plug it in. A quick tip to prevent the cord from getting disconnected is to tie a loose knot between the extension cord and the fogger before connecting them. The last thing we'll cover before we get out there and start slaying some bugs is safety gear. Now, although the product is all natural and very safe when used as directed, it's still a good idea to wear a set of safety glasses and a mask just in case some of the product happens to blow back on you whenever you're applying it. When it comes to operating the fogger, it's super easy. Simply turn it on, and when you're ready to spray, open the valve. Spray shrubs, window frames, and along the sides of your house and patio. You can also spray roof areas and along gutters, pretty much anywhere where bugs tend to live. Be sure to also treat plants that have suffered leaf damage from insects. The product will kill any existing insects along with their larvae. Now, depending on how bad the infestation is that you're dealing with, you may have to do a follow-up application within two weeks. Once you have everything under control, though, figure every three to four weeks is a good application schedule to keep outdoor pests away. I love it when a plan comes together.